What's up everyone and welcome back to Movie Rays. Hero finds Tiffin is a cool British actor, model, and even producer. You know, he really hit the big time when he took the role of Hardin Scott in the After series. But do you know who Hero finds Tiffin is dating in 2023? Well, believe it or not, Hero Tiffin has never actually been in a relationship. Yep, you heard that right. He's been flying solo his whole life. Surprising, huh? Hero himself spilled the beans on this surprising fact during an interview with Elle back in 2019. Not only does he not have a girlfriend, but he's never even been in a proper relationship. Who would have thought? Now, before you start thinking no one's interested in him, think again. This isn't about a lack of interest. The reason behind his single status might just be that he's super focused on his career. Or perhaps finding someone who clicks with him has been a bit of a challenge? In his own words, the sweetheart from Harry Potter and the Half-Blood Prince admitted, I've never had, like, a proper relationship. I haven't had a girl I would call my girlfriend. If you scroll through his social media, especially Instagram, it's all about his work-related posts and promoting his upcoming projects and movies. It seems like Hero's a pretty private guy when it comes to his personal life. And hey, even if he were to start dating someone, don't expect him to shout it out from the rooftops right away. He seems like the kind of person who'd keep things low-key, at least in the beginning. Now, you might be thinking that Hero's real-life persona might be a lot like his character Hardin Scott, right? Well, think again. He's quick to clarify that the only things he and Hardin have in common are being tall, skinny white guys with dark hair. In all his interviews, he comes across as sweet and softly spoken. Despite being British, Hero's more of an adorable, shy guy who wouldn't dream of doing some of the things Hardin Scott does. Oh, and here's a little nugget for you. There were some whispers about him and a certain actress he worked with in one of his movies. But remember, even though the rumor mill churns, Hero's relationship status remains resolutely single. But first, let's rewind a bit and see how Hero Tiffin kicked off his journey in the acting world and how his childhood played a part in shaping him. Before Hero shot to fame, he went through quite a hustle to make his acting dreams come true. He had some interesting gigs before becoming a big shot actor. Picture this, he was once a landscaper and even tried his hand at catering. Can you believe it? He even had a moment where he thought being a caterer might be more stable than pursuing acting. But lucky for us, he eventually took a chance and auditioned for the role of Hardin Scott sparking a roller coaster of love and frustration for fans. After being in the movie After, Hero's life changed a lot. In a talk with W Magazine, Hero talked about how surprised he was by all the attention and publicity he got. He said the fans, especially for After, are crazy. They're everywhere and really excited and supportive. Anna Todd tried to tell us, but I didn't think it would be as crazy as she said, especially now that we're making it into a movie. He admitted, I thought, yeah, it can't be that bad, but guess what? It was even crazier than he thought. It seems like the days of struggling to be noticed are over for him and that makes us happy. He also remembered his auditions before getting the main role in the movie that made him famous. Even though he's different from the character Hardin in real life, he felt a strong connection with the character. He said the character is really interesting for an actor's first big role. There are many layers you show to the audience. And don't forget that all the hard work, long hours, and different opinions during filming were fun for Hero. He really loves his job and that shows in his performances. All right, let's dive into some juicy tidbits about Hero Finds Tiffin's romantic situation, shall we? Now, I know many of you were absolutely entranced by all the fame and excitement he experienced while filming the series. But let's talk about that intriguing rumor that had everyone buzzing. The possibility that Hero and his on-screen love interest, Josephine Langford, were more than just co-stars. I mean, who wouldn't want that, right? If you've watched all three movies, you've likely felt the undeniable chemistry they shared on screen. It was a mix of sensuality and maturity that was hard to ignore. But their relationship was actually purely platonic. Yep, they're good pals in real life, and Hiro mentioned that he still chats with her quite a bit these days. 
In fact, he keeps in touch with a bunch of the after cast members. So while they had those sweet and intimate moments on screen, it turns out that real-life romance just wasn't in the cards for them. Oh, and don't think we missed those adorable snapshots they've shared. Remember that one Instagram post from at after movie where Josephine took some selfies with Hero? He had his head cozily resting on her shoulder and she even had her hand on his cheek. The two of them looked like a match made in heaven, didn't they? Alas, the spark we all hoped for didn't ignite behind the scenes. Now here's the real question on everyone's minds. How in the world could these two keep it strictly just friends after three seasons of playing such intense, intimate roles? Well, it seems like they're the epitome of professional actors. They've got that knack for keeping their personal and professional lives separate, which is pretty impressive. So even though we might not see them as a couple off-screen, we can still swoon over their cute pictures and indulge in a bit of daydreaming, right? Here's another mind-blowing tidbit. Hiro and Josephine apparently had a mere 10-minute introduction before diving into those sizzling, steamy scenes together. Can you believe it? I mean, talk about some serious talent to build such intense chemistry in such a short span of time. Hiro spilled the beans saying, we met in the hotel lobby 10 minutes before we were going to go and make dinner with producers and directors. And from that brief encounter, they managed to create the kind of chemistry that had fans totally hooked. That's some Hollywood magic right there. Now let's chat about Josephine for a moment. Just like Hero, she's a pro at keeping things under wraps. Not only does she steer clear of putting her relationships on display, but she also seems to be steering clear of the social media frenzy. In her own words, my brain has so many qualities that do not work with social media. For example, I'm an overthinker, I'm openly private, and those two personality traits do not work when it comes to Instagram. She went on to explain, no one I know in real life has ever asked me why I follow this person or why I don't follow this person because everyone knows it does not correlate with people who are important in my life. So I don't even check my Instagram feed. It's meaningless is what I'm trying to say. You've got to hand it to her for staying true to herself and not getting caught up in the whole social media whirlwind. In a world where the Kardashians dominate, she's definitely standing out as her own kind of icon, the Langford way. Well, that's it. For now, make sure that you like our video. Please share your views and opinions in the comments section with us. Subscribe to the channel to get updated regularly with the latest news and reviews on upcoming movies from us. And do not forget to hit the bell icon to never miss an update. Thanks for watching the video. We'll see you at the next one.